Hi there, this is Abhishek and in this video I will talk about the input field feature of QuickView. This input field option helps us to dynamically change the field values in the front end. So for example, I have already made sales as in one of the input field and what I am trying to do here, if you can see this arrow sign is coming and what is this indicating is it is an input field and I can change the value dynamically if I hit click on this then you can see this value has become now editable and I can change whatever value I want so now I will just keep it as it is what was there and it, it not only changed the field but if you are using this value in some other calculation like in this table I am using sales target and the achievement based on the target specified then the relevant percentages are coming so if I change anything here say for example the target is suppose 6 and uh, sales is uh, 4 so I just need to click on this button to make it editable I incorrectly press the or click over here so that's why it has filtered it I will again click and it, it will remove the selection so to make it editable let's quickly hit this on this arrow and make it 6 and you will see the value is changed 200% which is a calculated value in another table so you can see this uh, it can be very helpful in such scenarios where you want to do some kind of what if analysis or you have some kind of a requirement where you need to change your values dynamically and you don't want to go back into the script or you don't want to go back into the database or somewhere and do that uh, uh, change so let's see in the back end how we need to do an arrangement so for this we need to go into edit script and here is the same option that we need to specify input field and sales is what we have specified and then the same field we are using over here while importing the data from this xls file so this is specifying that uh, sales field which earlier has been specified as an editable should act as an editable field in the front end so I'll just close this and show you how we can use this over here so the box the table box which I am using is uh, the same table box however the sales value if I'm using here when I'm using here it is not a table box but it is a metric or or a metric chart simple table chart so in this simple table chart it will not be editable to make it editable a particular field we have to use it into a table box and that's the catch here and after that you can change whatever you want and uh, make it uh, useful in your front end and all of your calculation will be updated like this um, apart from this very quickly let's quickly go back to edit script by hitting ctrl e and uh, make target also editable so i will just simply put comma and say target save it and load it quick close okay and now you will see now my target field is also editable so you can specify comma and make your multiple fields editable and then do your analysis in the front end on the fly without have without uh, making any changes into the backend database or into the um, excel file or anywhere but once probably if the changes are confirmed then you may want to go back and change it according to your requirement so that's a quick video i wanted to show uh, for input field i hope uh, it will be useful for you and i will meet you in the next video with a new topic